We're Mosaic, and we're 300 feet up, where we see Saskatchewan's potash remaining an asset for generations. We can see tomorrow from here, and when tomorrow arrives, we'll still be here, beside you. Come on, there's Jan Kamenko coming up the ice, across the Tiger line, off the glove, he scores! Oh -ho! Jan Kamenko gives the Warriors a 1-0 lead. He walks up the right wall, Brook at the blue line, left side, sight, Sev, race shot, they score! Thomas Foster catches a piece of that puck, and the Warriors will take a 2-0 lead. 2-0 lead, a Parrish and Heimbecker goal from Thomas Foster. Here's the Tigers, Owry scores! That's how quick things can change when you play the Medicine Hat Tigers. One little bobble in the neutral zone and they have a two-on-one, and they've come right back in this game. Tree side seven, should be side seven, Brooke, should it not? I believe so. Here the Tigers score! John Dahlstrom has even the game up at two. Warriors skate, Thomas Foster with speed coming in on the FC inside, coming left, looks for Hall, the goal walks, that maybe went off a pad. Flat coming up the right wall, to the blue line thrower, snap shot, Pooley Hans about two feet outside of his crease as he snatches that one with his glove. Thrower going after Fisher, and they're gonna square off and drop the gloves and go. Good bombs, thrower chucking some rights. Fisher's trying to get in tight. Fisher gets back up, thrower puts him back down on the ice. The fans love it. Josh Thrower's got everybody on their feet. Looks to the crowd and says, come on, get up, let's get going. On the left wing, cuts across the Warrior line. Left circle, Shaw looking back to Bradley. What a stop by Sachenko! Robs him with the left pad. As Dahlstrom had a chance, Henderson. At the left point, floating shot, they score! John Dahlstrom will get his second of the game as he'll tip it past Zach Sachenko, and the Tigers have the lead. On the left wing side, Foster to the right, looking to the middle, Wu puts it off the pad, it's stuck in the crease, Warriors banging away, they throw it out in front, Howden unable to pull the trigger on the shot. Right boards, Burzan swings it to the goal line, trying to get in front, drives the net, just put it wide through the paint. Raising in down the right wing, Langan through the middle, backhand pad save made by Bouillon. Rolling puck comes behind the net. Jano hard below the goal line, battling with McPherson. Burke takes it, throws it in front, they score! <laughs> Noah Gringer has tied it at three. It's a Noah Gringer, great heads up play, but let's rewind to the beginning of that. That doesn't happen without Tanner Janot's second effort getting that puck. Lays it back behind the net. Braden Burke able to pick it up and he has such great vision. And Noah Gregor with great timing to the front of the net. Bang, bang, play. Paul Bigel walks right circle, shot shoulder save. Howden trying to pick the rebound. Looking to slide the puck in and just out of the reach of Paul Bigel walks. Oh, to the goal line, Chano trying to stuff it. Takes it behind the net, backhand wraparound. Second chance, he scores! Oh yeah! with 1.46 to go in the game, has given the Warriors the lead. What a play by number 10. Oh, we talked about it earlier. It's just that effort. Go, go, go by Tanner Janot. From behind the net around, he tries to stuff it one way, doesn't work, comes back around, tries to stuff it the other way, gets stopped, but he wouldn't quit and bangs it in. Thomas Foster will skate this puck into the empty net. Yeah! Standing ovation for the Warriors as they win their eighth straight game, knocking off the Central Division leading Medicine Hat Tigers 5-3, scoring three goals in the third period to come from behind. The record now 40-17-7-1.
and a present for Hall of Famers Kevin and Ryan Smith. The Warriors deliver an entertaining win here tonight.